Good morning and welcome to the GHS Reporter. Today is Thursday, May 30th and I'm Bella Jordan. Star Wars Galaxy's Edge opens tomorrow at Disneyland in California. According to CNN, the 14-acre expansion opens tomorrow where you can interact with ships, creatures, lightsabers, and droids. But until June 30th, guests will only have a four-hour window to stay in the new land. The Millennium Falcon Smuggler's Run attraction will open tomorrow while the second ride, Rise of the Resistance, will open later this year. In the shops, you are able to get talking porgs or a Kowakian monkey lizard, among other alien animals. Build your own BB unit or R2 Astro Merge droid and build your own lightsaber. Star Wars Galaxy's Edge will be opening in Walt Disney World August 29th in Disney's Hollywood Studios. Alliance is hosting a coffee house in room 610 today after school from 2.30 to 4.30. Admission is free and there will be hot chocolate, baked goods, and coffee for sale. There will also be a raffle. All are welcome. Sign-ups for fall sports have begun. Physicals will be given in the nurse's office on Tuesday, June 4th from 3.30 to 5.30 p.m. Sports will begin August 19th. Shakespeare Society will be putting on its production of Twelfth Night tomorrow and Saturday at 7 p.m. Admission is free and snacks and refreshments will be available. We hope to see you there. Unified Basketball will be playing its final game tonight at the West Gym at 5.45. After a 46-38 win over Avril Park in the semifinals, the Dutchman will take the, count, the court tonight for the championship. The Dutchman come in the finals with five wins and one loss. The team encourages everyone to come and watch their game. That's all for the GHS Reporter today. Remember to find today's announcements online and on Twitter at GHS Announcement. I'm Bella Jordan. Today is a D-Day. Have a great day.